for 25 hours. What are we doing in Thailand? Well, you know uh, the company DJI, they make the drones that I, that, I, that I film with. They flew me out to make a little like short film piece about me. So I'm actually only gonna be in front of the camera this time, which is very strange. And um, it's so exciting, this project. Like they showed me the storyboard and it's just so cool what they're, what they're gonna be filming. And we're going out to the islands and, uh, and it's one of those, those projects that you know when something comes up and you're so excited about it but you you don't want to get too excited because you think no it's it's not gonna happen or it's gonna get cancelled or, or shifted or something but now I'm here it's happening and yeah I'm gonna bring you with me if if you want to come you you guys know me like I, I I'm in a different country almost every three weeks or two weeks but still it blows my mind just the fact that you start your morning in one world and you finish your evening in a totally different environment Environment in a totally different country. Like I, I was, I woke up this morning in my parents' place in uh, in Byron Bay in Australia, which is this little place on the on the beach, and uh, and, and now here I am in this in this Asian city uh, in Bangkok, 4 a.m. It's just ah, oh, it blows my mind. to check in Kulin Gacho, go to Sydney, from Sydney to Bangkok. I get into Bangkok, Thailand at 1 a.m. tonight. I'm so excited. This bag weighs a ton. It's got my drone, my cameras. Technically, it's a little bit heavier than it should be, but they never, they never seem to weigh it. I just have to like, I always try to carry it pretending like it's really light so they don't ask me. You see, this is me trying to pretend like my bag is not heavy at all so no one pulls me up for being double the weight allowance with my carry-on. first class on Emirates to the most beautiful airplane seat I've ever seen in my life. I am not just great, I am euphoric. And then in the bathroom, I discover this. As you guys might know, if you saw my get up and run conversations with the heart, I was up until 4 a.m. every night the past week making that and also editing a new TV series. So I'm, I'm pretty wrecked. Thank you. 
Hello. How are you? I'm sorry it's so late it's at okay. night. It's okay. Are you from Bangkok? Bangkok. Or? You yeah. are? Yes. Oh, cool. Terrible. <laughs> no, no, me too. I'm like sweaty and tired. I'll put I the. I look up in bed. <laughs> <laughs> no, you look lovely. You look wonderful. What's life like in Bangkok? Busy. Busy. Yeah. Busy. But you, but you like it? Yes. Yeah. But can't imagine how, how can I live somewhere else? Really? Do most people live outside of the city or do you, you know property, piece of land? condominium or apartments downtown it's very expensive really yeah. yeah there are two groups that live in downtown one is they live there since their ancestor they're passing on the will the inheritance the house, yes. yeah they don't have to buy it then no. yeah and the second group new generation new millionaire like a Thai millionaire or, yeah. or what makes you love Bangkok everything yeah. yeah good food good people big busy city I'm so excited. Okay. I'm so glad you're here. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. I've never seen someone look so like cheerful and, and friendly at like this time in the morning after. This time in the morning, yeah, yeah. grumpy, right? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> okay, here we go. Home sweet home. Good night, Bangkok. Good night. Lovely people, see you tomorrow. Next episode. I did something last night, kind of a bit crazy. I hope I know where I'm going. <laughs>